Oh, hey guys. Yes. Do you watch Lifetime movies? We did. We watched the wrong Mr. Right. My name is Bran Bran. To my right, Brian. To my farther right, Chris <laughs> Ridley. What'd you think? Recommend? No. Uh, uh, no from you? Yeah. Uh, no. No. Nope. Uh, it is a big no from me as well. Uh, so in the three movies that yes. we've watched so far, they all have the same thing where the movie starts off with what happens towards the end. Yes. Yes. Yep. yes. They want you to know how the movie is going to be before you see how the movie is going to be. Uh, the main title card for this is fucking hilarious. Yes. It's like an America's Most Wanted. It's like, yeah. <laughs> Just the ghost right. Vivica A. Fox. Of course. Yeah. I, and like, didn't she like produce it too? I yeah, think so. Like, and I, I know she's in a ton of these. Oh, I and it seemed, yeah. And it's, and I think it's all the wrong, whatever. Yeah. She's in all the, the wrong the house, the wrong kid or whatever, the wrong you know thing. It is, it's, it's her. In the beginning when I think it's her or no, is it the mom? Let's that? say the phrase getting it in. Oh, stop it. Newsflash, young lady. Women over 40 are still getting it in and having sex. I'm mm. still getting banged by dudes. <laughs> like, wait, she could have just said that. I've been fine. Uh, I'm having a, what, nah, what was she in? Really. Uh, Vivica, Vivica, Vivica like, besides this, like, was she was she the what's her face from uh, the Will Smith movie? Uh, um, Independence Day? Was she, yes. She was the wife? She was Will okay. Smith's wife in Independence Day. What else? What else has she done? I, don't, uh, I, I feel like she's done a ton, though. She was Kill Bill in Kill Bill, but I forget oh, yeah. which role. And, oh, she's also in Independence Day 2, which... Doesn't exist. <laughs> I don't know. The, the, when I hear her name, it just seems like she's like this, like a big star. Mm. But then I turn to think of what she's done, and she really is very meh. Yeah. Yeah. How okay. come everyone is dressed like a Gap ad? Yeah. Like no logo or like yeah. sayings yeah. on their shirts. Yeah. There's no like, graphic tees or anything. Yeah, right. Nothing. Right. No Ed Hardy, bro. <laughs> no. Is it even clothing? Yeah. Exactly. <laughs> you know? Yeah. Yeah. You were saying the mom was wearing those like. Oddly cut overalls that like almost showed her like butt crack, and that was weird. Well, yeah, it seemed like <laughs> tramp stamp. Yes. Well, it seemed like all the clothes the mom had were like four t sizes too big for her. She wasn't wearing anything that fit. Right. And I had a problem with that. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> That's fine. <laughs> it's the fashion report with <laughs> Bran Bran. <laughs> <laughs> that's my. Yeah, that's how I don't like it. <laughs> Capri pants alert. <laughs> 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 what? <laughs> No, that's fine. I like I it. Want it to be a thing. Yeah. <laughs> uh, once so, again, in this movie, everybody calls each other babe. Yes, I'm fucking over. It. Yeah, it's a lot everybody. Of babe. Like I, I started writing out all the time people, uh -huh. and then I just got tired of it. I'm like, no. <laughs> oh, Other see, people. I noticed all the times that the the boyfriend Paul Riley would call the daughter kiddo. Kid yes. Oh. No, kiddo. I I sure didn't. Look, kiddo. <sighs> kiddo. Good morning, kiddo. Thanks a lot, kiddo. Got you, kiddo. Told you, kiddo. You should have just asked me, kiddo. Dad. How old is she supposed to be? Well, she, like she's in grad school. Like, she's yeah. got to be like in her early twenties, like okay. 22, 23 or something like that. Okay. So it's it's not like like okay, your mom has a boyfriend. You'd be like, okay, cool. Like as long as he's yeah. a nice dude. Well, yeah, and it sounds like she's just there for like summer break or something. Right. So, exactly. like, why like, does she care if he's moving in? Right. Like, exactly. So that's my biggest <laughs> yeah. segue. Right. That's my biggest complaint about this movie is everyone is a terrible person. Oh yeah. I oh, feel yeah. like with the two other movies, there's at least like one person you could maybe relate to. Yeah. This everyone is awful. Yeah. <laughs> Big yeah. time. The daughter. I mean, she's a bitch. Yep. She's yeah. like a. Yeah, just yeah. straight up bitch. Yeah, big time. I thought was really funny was uh, when she was working at the restaurant in Vivica. She's like, "No, don't you go in the kitchen? Don't you snoop it in the kitchen?" And I'm just like, "Well, she works there. Like, <laughs> <laughs> what is she? How is she waitress? Yeah, you and she have to go back there. Yeah. I mean, do we want to talk about you know the elephant in the room like with the daughter, or you know the eye of the elephant in the room? <laughs> what? What are you? <laughs> She's a wonky eye, dude. I just figured she was just goofy looking. So I didn't realize, I didn't like make the connection. I was like, oh, look at this weird looking chick. And it's weird because it seems like they keep on having her look in the direction where it's the most apparent that she has. Cause like, especially I bet in the that's what the director did. It's like, oh, watch this guy. He's hilarious. <laughs> you know, cause like in that scene, like that one of the first scenes where like the mom and the daughter are like arguing in the kitchen. It's just like, they keep going back. I knew something was off about her. 
Maybe that was it. I'm not odd, but you know what I mean. It's like, she's not a normal person. Yeah. Well, <laughs> so like thir- 34 minutes in, I think it's the daughter, the mom. I forget <laughs> if the boyfriend is there, but like everyone has crazy eyes. Yeah. <laughs> but crazy eyes. Yeah. 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 And you know, I, I, the, the part where the mom comes in, I guess she was playing basketball with the boyfriend. Oh my God. It's like, she's like sports ball. Plays, yeah. I'm like, yeah. No. Yeah. No sports ball in the house. Yes, That's that, the rule. Yeah. yeah. It's a house full of adults. <laughs> yeah. I'm like, what rule? Like, oh my God. Yeah. And the amount of times that basketball is in this yeah. r- reminds me of yes. football yep. in the room. Yes. 100%. <laughs> yeah. 100%. Yeah. This is, it was, oh. Okay. And so this chick is like snooping on this guy going yes. through his stuff. She's finding, so she finds a driver's license with a different name. Yeah. She finds all <laughs> the this awesome stuff. stock photo. Yes. Like- <laughs> There's a lot of red flags that she's finding, which is like, okay, this is really early in the movie. Like she's oh. finding all this stuff where the, oh, the, mo- the mom guaranteed is going to kick him out. Right. Well, she's oh like, no. She's like, no, no. He, oh, he explained all this to me. It, it, yeah. it, it, it's I, I didn't fine. think the mom's got to kick him out. Like you'd, you'd think any normal person would be like, oh, this, there's, this is really weird. Can you please like leave my house? No. And she doubled down on it. She's like, yeah. no, no, I want you to stay. I don't but care. I mean, it's a, like psycho granny. Same yeah. thing where like that main character was just like totally oblivious. Yeah, I know. It just uh, drive. This is why these movies drive me insane. Yeah. That's why, because you can see it's so clear as day. The main character in, uh, well, no, she was crazy too. Never mind. <laughs> yeah. You know what time it is? Tool time? You know what time it is? Game time? You know what time it is. Oh, no. It's time to get to know Paul time. <laughs> <laughs> do you know what time it is? Do you, do you know what time? You know what time? You know what time is? It's get know. to know Paul Riley time. Thought, that's what time. I is. thought that's okay. What time it is get to know Paul right Riley time. Like, I question. would get up and walk away if someone did that to me. <laughs> Good day, sir. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't think there's any way to convey without just showing the entire scene. There's no way to convey how crazy that basketball scene is. <laughs> it's just uh, in terms of acting and it goes on for a long yeah, time. Yeah. Yep. Also, yeah. <laughs> and also the rim was super low too. Yes, it was. <laughs> oh yeah. Oh yeah. <laughs> and yeah. everyone was playing basketball in jeans. <laughs> yes. <laughs> That'll yes. Feel Which great I've, I've, I've done that before. You played best b ball, b ball and jeans. Yeah. It was like, yeah, the last time I played in jeans, it was like, early 2000s and I'm reminded of this. This isn't something I remembered because because this is when I smoked cigarettes at the time and they still remind me like, oh, remember when you played basketball in jeans and you were smoking your cigarette at the same time? Yeah, I, I, yeah. So if you find out that he's not a good guy, you know, because he's talking to his brother at the bar and, uh, the, and then the brother's like, hey, you wanted me to do more. I, I get some more money from this and he's like, oh, yeah, yeah. And the brother whole, gets it. That whole scene though. Yeah, because like the bartender's like, hey, we good here? Yeah. And he's like, we were good. And the bartender's yes. like, all right. So you guys good here? We were. Yeah, he's <laughs> like, hey, backs yeah. up. So are you good? <laughs> <Right, yeah. laughs> you want a drink or no? Right. <laughs> you, yeah, help me out here. It's like, dude, I don't have time for this shit. Uh, 41 and a half. Yeah. Eric Roberts. Yes. Hal. Of uh, Runaway I'm, Train and Best of the Best fame. Puppet Tommy. Shit to me, Puppet! <laughs> I guess he's in a lot of Lifetime movies. Oh, really? Yeah, and this, this is all from, my, again, my friends that have watched a ton. I get a lot of info from them. He's in a lot. And hmm. my friend did say he's seen this one already. And he said he was very upset that um, he, uh, you see what happens to Hal. It's very Lots up. That, that, of but you don't see use what happens. Yeah. yeah, a lot. Yeah. yeah, definitely. And I like how the bar bathroom, you could tell it was just a legit someone's bathroom in their house, yes. both red, like <laughs> string lights. Yeah. It's like, ooh, bar. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> the, the bar restaurant where the boyfriend proposed to the mom. Oh. <laughs> the beginning of the scene shows a piano player. And then it cuts to someone seasoning like a nice steak. All oh, right, yeah. right. And it right. cuts to a bartender making a fancy cocktail. Right. And then, you know, they're having the scene and the boyfriend proposes. But he proposes by basically going, look over there. Yeah. <laughs> and Is then, that not your friend with the thing? <laughs> yeah. And, and then like, when she no. turns around, like he pulls out a ring, whatever. But when he says, look over there, the camera cuts to the bar, restaurant, right. whatever. 
And it's literally a bar, and there's video games on the TV. I didn't notice that. I didn't notice that. So I'm amazing. curious what place has soft <laughs> piano steaks and cocktails and video games with lots of neon. That's right. So great. Nothing made sense. Uh, yet another Lifetime movie, the friend character knows a private investigator. Yes. yes. Oh, that's right. It was his <laughs> yeah. guy. Yeah, yeah. So Hal, yeah, it was the godfather. It was, uh, what's his face? The, the boy, the, the the love interest of the, the, the girl. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, I forget it. So, yeah, because uh, <laughs> yeah, I think when, and I think one of the times that the boyfriend gets the phone call from Hal, yeah. he co- he's fresh out of the shower yeah. and he's bone dry. Oh, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Hey, oh, all right. But, yeah. um, and then, yeah, Hal talks to the daughter yes. on the phone, and he's like, oh, yeah, this is going on. This is going on. And he's like, oh, anything else funny? Oh, you know, uh, this boy, uh, the the boyfriend has a brother. She goes, another name, another lie. And he's like, another name, another yeah. lie. Yeah. Yeah. Like, another name, another lie. Another name, another lie. It's like, <laughs> uh, are you guys not listening to right. each other? Like, That's what yeah. I just said. And then when Paul finds the daughter's phone on the couch, he's yes. like snooping through it. It says Hal, yes, private investigator, and he's like, and his oh, full address, and, and like, right, yeah, right. and he was like, hey, uh, well, so uh, you know, what do you mean by type of business? Oh, I'm a private investigator. A private investigator, <laughs> oh, motherfucker! It's on the fucking phone. Like Stop. you took a picture of it, like you <laughs> idiot. After that. I'm I'm thinking Vivica better just save the day to like save this movie. V- Vivica better be the one to save In her the day. sweet yellow zebra outfit. Yeah, she just do something. And then you see that lady sitting in a park with this like ceramic like or bone china tea set. <laughs> You're just like, oh, oh it's just, so what? I don't know. Was that a park? Was that her home? I, I have, thought it was her home. I thought it was a park. Was there something off about her? No. Yeah. So. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. The so this is gonna tie into a bigger thing. This whole movie is shot in a very unflattering light, yeah. literally and figuratively. Yeah. 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 Right. Everyone looks very wonky. It's yeah. very so I think that actress I'm I assume looks fine, but just the lighting and it's like yeah, because it's like they didn't like light her eyes at right. all. So it's just like she looked like somebody that like oh like there's like oh, do you want to do an interview? Like just somebody that you'd yeah. like, like a reporter, like, you know, you, you watch the news and someone to interview somebody. It was that kind of quality. Right, they didn't but like it was, do anything. No, but like, it was almost like there's like no hair and makeup. I don't right. know if they even like, had like a saying. costume yeah. of any yeah, kind. Yeah, like, like no wardrobe. And it's like they yeah. just jacked her in the top part of her mouth and like, okay, yeah, go. Yeah, yeah, have fun. Yeah, my husband. Yeah. Like, yeah. yeah, like, no, yeah, yeah, you had a husband, sure, lady. <laughs> <laughs> no one loves you. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, and uh, the only people I would recommend this movie to is like unflattering people. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> if you're Ogo, this is for you. No, like people who want to learn about like filmmaking, because I get the sense that they had nice cameras and nice lenses yeah. and nice lights, but they didn't know how to use them because <laughs> there is so much up lighting in yeah. this movie. We're like everyone. It's like, it's Frankenstein lighting yeah. basically where it's like yeah. the light yeah. is low pointing up. So that like, bonfire like spooky story like yeah. look. right because at 28 minutes when the boyfriend and the daughter are talking at the restaurant they're both talking in the booth but it's like just framed like from here up right oh and both of them yeah it's like super weird yeah yeah well and in the very first dialogue scene same thing it's framed very oddly lit very oddly so me and Stacey were like is that a green screen in a <laughs> restaurant like so and that's like it was very just like Shot of girl, shot of boy, yeah. Yeah. shot of girl. There's right. no like, yeah. sh- like wide shot of both of them. Right. So it's just super it was weird. Very weird. Very weird. Hour, hour 16. Yeah. The boyfriend, he gets a call like, like, ah, shit's yeah. going down. You yeah. Know? And uh, he's like, he's like, all right, I'll be right over. And like, he's like watching soccer with his dad. Yeah. yeah. And like, he's like, everything all right. And he's like, he's like, ah, oh, something bad's going down. Yeah. He's like. You want me to come with? He's like, no, no. He's like, all right. Yeah, 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 yeah. 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 He's like, oh, it's fine. He, just, he does not give yeah. a shit. And Why like, is he even in this movie now that I think about I it? I don't know. I have no idea, dude. Uh, uh, Tiger, you really must care about her. Like, yeah. Stupid. It's at the end, and you've, the bag, the, the boyfriend ties them both up. The mom's losing her shit. Like uh, sobbing uncontrollably. Another lifetime movie where people get tied to a chair, yes. but go ahead. Yeah. <laughs> so the mom's losing her shit. The daughter's just kind of like, oh, this sucks. You know, she's not happy about it. And then, like, Vivica shows up, boom, shoots him, 
Now, okay. Now, I don't know if you guys caught this. Mm -hmm. Okay. So Vivica shoots the dude. Yes. She's in the looking at him. Yes. The entire time. Yes. <laughs> the, she, like the people that get untied, they run over to Vivica. Vivica is still staring right. at yep. where the guy is on the ground bleeding. Yes. He's not there anymore. Yeah. No blood. He's gone. He's gone. <laughs> right. It's like, wait, what? Was he a so ghost? The best part is when she goes, girl, you picked the wrong Mr. Right. Yep. And I'm like, yeah! yeah. <laughs> she said the thing! <laughs> yeah, and then it just, like, do you, I don't remember. Do you see what happens? Do, what yeah. the so the little epilogue scene is, <laughs> and same thing, like, I swear to, you could see, like, on the screen, the budget gets slashed dramatically. Yeah. <laughs> it's like the vi like the qu the video quality, like, drops. Right. So it suddenly, like, takes place in Texas or whatever. Yeah. <laughs> but it's like two older women, like, oh, I met someone online. That's right. And it's the dude, but just in a cowboy hat now. <laughs> that's, that, yeah, he's like, howdy, y'all. And yeah. Yeah, she's like, oh, I'm glad you came with me. I didn't want to meet him without yeah. anybody. Right. And then, like, they both look at each other like, ooh, he's yeah. so yeah. handsome. And I'm like, ah, you can, you know, you can just wait. You guys are going to get him. <laughs> And then it said, you know, there's still like 15,000 children left in Vietnam. Exactly, which is weird, but <laughs> that's fine. It didn't fit, you know? No, yeah, yeah. <laughs> These movies don't have, like, conclusions, if that makes right. sense. Well, like, they leave them open for sequels. I, I guess But so. how often but, do Lifetime movies get sequels, though? The, well, the, well, there's like a million of the wrong whatever, but I don't yeah. know if it's the same. I don't think they're right. sequels, though. No. Least, it, yeah, I it's, I don't, I don't know how you can watch this and be like, I'm satisfied with that ending. The guy got away. You know, these, these people's lives are ruined. They're going to have trauma. But it's it's fine. It was a good ending. <laughs> no, it wasn't. It wasn't. Don't make any more of these yeah, I mean, basically, none of the main characters died. So I guess it's a happy ending. <laughs> uh, the only other note I'll make is... Uh, but I think it's when the daughter's snooping through the boyfriend's like wooden box or whatever. Oh yeah, he comes across all the old photos of the boyfriend with different girlfriends. Yeah, I don't know if you guys noticed it, but they're all horribly photoshopped. <laughs> so like oh, that God. actor's face is just like terribly like pasted <laughs> in all these photos. That's amazing. So it's like different lighting, different like. <laughs> oh, it, it, hey, that guy's brown. That's so great. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Okay. So where do you guys stand on it? You no, still know? No, no. Yeah. Big old stinker for me as well. Yeah. Till next time. The journey. If you like Nick Cage and horrible great movies from the Canon Group Films, then like, comment, and subscribe for Nick Uncaged Podcast.